There we go. So it started. Oh no. Is there some sort of update? Software update. Oh, for OBS. Eh, whatever. I'll do it later. Um, okay, we're we're streaming. We're live. And and uh, yeah. Wait, actually, I don't need to do that. I can just go here. Um, all right. Let me let me start the thing. Sorry, uh, that was me being late. Um, not Jesse. I got uh, held up two separate times, and so that is my bad there. Um, Tanguy is back. Hey. Ah, Tanguy. Uh, bonjour, Tanguy. Uh, alors, 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 nous parlons, nous, uh, nous parlons français. Oui. Uh, moi et Jesse. Tu parles français? No. Pourquoi? Oh, you're totally. Your font window is totally covering my shirt. It is. Here, let's let's switch to the other one real quick. Um, because I can just I can just switch back and forth real easy. There we go. Um, I need to turn down the volume on my phone. Um, I need to do the ring notifications thing. Um, okay. Oh, Tanguy says your French is flawless. Oh, oh très bien, <laughs> très bien. Okay. Uh, I I love speaking French because it's so much fun. But then sometimes I forget the things that you're supposed to say. Um. um and, oh my god, Jonathan, lang time no see. <laughs> <laughs> um, nice. And Evan, the red dots represent patrons who are also supporters in season one. The black dots then are season two supporters. And so we'll keep using different colors as we move forward to show how many seasons people have been with us. Oh, and thank you. Yes, I also love my shirt. Yeah, I think it's going to get really, really confusing and mixed up and need a lot of colors unless we just do it based on the number of seasons. So it's like, we could do separate ones for like, this person was a patron in season one and season three, but not season two, you know what I mean? Or we could just do two seasons. I was promised a rainbow. <laughs> and yes, it, it is a pride shirt. It is indeed. Mm. And Jonathan, you know what? A good pun is reusable, always. <laughs> See, anime fan Jesse doesn't get that because she hasn't seen Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventure. Despite the fact that she grew up in the same era I did. I like it. it's like same era, not like the exact same years. <laughs> well, I, I, I didn't want to say the year, but I guess I could. I think we have mentioned several times that we are the same age. Yeah. Well, I mean, not. Have we not? Not really. I'm a lot older than you. Um, yes. A because lot wiser. Five months is huge. A lot wiser. A lot more experienced. I mean, it was a different world on January twentieth, nineteen eighty one, than it was in May twenty fourth, nineteen eighty one. Give me a break. Like. Yeah, oh, not only five months, five months and four days. It's the four days that did it. The you, five months would have been fine. You weren't even alive when the hostages came back. Four months. It's only four months between January and May. <laughs> what hostages? Oh, it... Exactly. Oh. See? <laughs> Noelle says, excellent. Our great hair. I added the excellent. <laughs> okay. Hey. Ragdoll, Ragdoll you too? I should see it. Holy smoke. Oh, Ragdoll's in the 81 Club, too? Nice. Kitty. Kitty, come here. Everybody wants to see you. Kitty cat. No, you're not <laughs> luring me away. I'm luring you here. Come here. Come on, kitty oh, cat. Oh, Mateus, are you reporting the score? Uh, oh. What, uh, what, uh, is it, what is it, an international friendly, or is it Champions League? What is it? Come here. Come here, kitty cat. Oh, Ragdoll is in between us. Oh! February 25th, 1981. Oh, and Tangi is a tiny bit younger than us. Oh, my <laughs> Just God. Just a tiny bit. That's when, my, that's when my sister was born. Oh, my God. European Championship, David. He's chasing a cat now. What is it? Uh, European Championship. Who's playing? 
Probably Germany and Portugal, right? Or Germany and Spain? Oh, it was postponed. The 2020 was postponed to this year. You can't do that. Like, <laughs> it's like a different team. They did. Oh, Magpies in the early 2000s squad. Nice. Okay, so Kitty is now on my lap. Can you see her? I, mean, I can. I don't know if they can. Just a second. I got to look over at the... Yes, yes, they saw her. Yeah. Oh. Oh, in Netherlands, Austria, please. Oh, so it's not the championship. It's um, it's just uh, earlier rounds. And of course, so like I said, like who is it? Germany and Portugal, and they're like, oh no, Germany and Portugal is Saturday. Ha ha ha. You totally called it. Yeah. Um. And hey, W. Watson, glad you are here. Man, remember that um, one year in the World Cup, it could have been Turkey and South Korea, but no, it just ended up being Germany, Brazil again. Ugh. So tired of that um, garbage. Um, as a total random side note, I don't know mm. if some people will be a tiny bit later. Yeah. Um, because I tweeted and put on Discord that we were running a tad bit behind, but don't worry, we'll be there kind of thing. So. Well, well Thank you for that. Thank you for you're, thank you for covering for me and my. I actually you outed yourself. I was just like, sorry, we're a bit late. Um, oh, that's right. We're a team. We were both late. Um, man, uh, re remember that time when France was playing Scotland to see who was going to go into the World Cup, and then France. Oh, sorry, no, it, was it Scotland or Ireland? Well, it was one of those two. But anyway. A uh, guy in France, uh, Henri, he totally cheated. He totally cheated. A pass came in, right? A pass came, sorry about that. A pass came in, it was like kind of like to the left of the goal, and he basically just with his hand tapped the ball back into play so that he or somebody else kicked it straight into the goal. It was like the most heinous red card ever, but the refs didn't see it. And so France went to the World Cup. Cheaters. It was, they said Ireland. Ireland, it was Ireland. Oh, ho, ho, ho. It was, mm. So yeah, I'm done with France in terms of, uh, of uh, international soccer. It, it was dead to me. Them and Italy and, and Germany because they're too good and Brazil because they're too good. And um, who is it? Argentina because they make me so mad. Um, by the way, Karis, uh, David remembers so many random things. Mm. I, yes, it is impressive, but like, just be ready. He can do this with a lot of subjects. Oh, Jonathan, don't bring it back up unless you got an answer. It's like, yeah, I asked me a couple of weeks ago where my, my, uh, where in Hungary my former violin teacher is from, <laughs> and you said I'm not sure, but it's somewhere in the south. Come on. <laughs> God, Tangi's response is great. Yes, you're right. There are many good-looking soccer players. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. They're second only to beach volleyball. Um, handball in the opponent's box is not a red, though. Come on. Okay. I don't even, are, we, are we ready to announce the poll from two weeks ago? Well, I'm not ready to deal with that garbage, so we better. <laughs> so, as a side note... For anyone who watched the episode we released last week, we had promised the name polls would go up. We and they did. did we did. So, so this week we need to have two polls. Whatever yeah. we decide in this episode and the name polls really need to go up. I've got the IPA, though. I've got the IPA. Yes. yes. So so don't worry. Like, we, we're, we're, we're there. Um, oh, cool. So do you want to pull up the images that we were voting on for the orthography? Yeah. It was the you know what? The curved J, flat J, metal edge, metal spike. Let me go ahead and start with an opening Quantra. tirade, okay? <laughs> so, I came up right with, like, where... <gasps> Uh-oh. Did they not save? Uh, no, no, no. Shoot, I have the wrong one. I have the wrong one. Because it's on my laptop. Okay, Jesse, entertain everybody. <clears throat> I'll be back. <laughs> I can easily entertain um, everyone. Because, yeah. um, so first and foremost, how's everyone doing? 
Oh, Jason, totally, yes. Flat J was the best. That was, that was also my favorite. Now, I won't tell you whether it won yet or not, but we will get to that in terms of results. <laughs> it is Jesse Tunner. And I'm like, what do I do now? Because we haven't really started yet. And tell David it's always been my show. It's all good. I don't know how Iron Maiden would be a word in this language, but we would have to uh, definitely some sort of compound and whatnot. Jesse Tunner speaking up. Um, and W. Watson, that's awesome that your comping is improving. And if you want to drop more details in terms of how it's improving, that is awesome. Um, and Jake, that's because you handed in your um, your thesis, right? Was it the thesis topic or was it um, the full thing? I forget. Yeah, <laughs> I should be a trust. If only, the only problem is his document is the one that's showing. And so even if I create a new document, I can't zoom it to his computer to make it open. Um, so, Tungi, that is a great question. Um, Jonathan, I'm happy for that, too. But where we are is that we are working on the orthography for the possum language. And um, in the meantime, I've been sort of creating new vocabulary. Now, today... I really need to play some catch up. And so there's really no way that we're going to be able to have the document do what we want it to because I need to enter in the dictionary all these nouns and verbs that we have created. Um, and so I, I don't know how we're going to do that and make it fun to watch on screen, but we'll figure it out. Dark Horse, you're right. Woodpecker language could be a fun sort of Morse code. Oh, and W Watson syntax is starting to exist. Nice. Oh, that's always exciting. Yeah, yeah. I know, Applesauce Project. Anytime we get to go back to Ingala, I'm like, oh. And that's why, like, if you keep up with my Instagram drawings, they've been rabbits this week. I was really excited to go back to Ingala. Okay, applications. Did you get the, uh, the shapes you needed? Well, actually, why don't I just leave it in Dropbox? Maybe that'll make things easier. Actually, <clears throat> let's give it a let's give it a let's give it a little Shotsky. I totally knew you were gonna say Shotsky. Mm -hmm. I did it for me, not for it's like you. The same way of mine. Mm. Oh no! Yeah, there's um. We have an Instagram account, and I do drawings. Okay, that's it. And put them up there. I know, Magpie, I feel the same way. If you notice, I just call this the possum language, um, because I just get tired of saying the name wrong. <laughs> the possum. Okay. Oh, you heard that? Yeah, there was a thing on the radio, and I was part of the interview. I forgot about that. <laughs> <laughs> Jake, yes. If you're not following on Instagram, I'll be getting half the story. Okay. So, um, does it show up? It sure does what not. Wait. No, it sure does not. Um, I need to change the, um, which window this is. Thank you, Noel. Um, so, Jonathan, it was... Through, um, okay, there we go. like the BBC Canada, and it was a radio segment, and I'm trying to remember oh, BBC. if they gave me a link or not. I honestly can't remember if I got a link to the whole thing. Um, I'm going to make myself a note, though. Yeah, Evan, you're right. CBC, there we go. And I'm going to try to remember, gosh, I really, really thought my allergies had calmed down. And only central vowels. <laughs> Those are your dogs. <laughs> I'm staring at you like, what just happened? Um, yes, 
Um, an awesome party. That's, that's really cool. Okay. Let's see. Wait, wait, wait. Let's see. <gasps> I no. Don't be cruel to us. That's true. Okay. Are we ready for my opening tirade? I'm ready. What what was your opening tirade as I'm trying not to sneeze? Okay. But yes, please. Okay. So I'm also trying to find if I can find a segment they could listen to. So oh crap, I don't have my other one. Oh, darn it, I need my other notebook. I'm gonna need to get up again. But um so um in fact you know what? No, forget it, forget it. You don't get to hear my opening tirade till I have my other notebook. One second. I feel um, so I found a link, but I don't know if this is, this is definitely part of one. Um, so that is definitely the same interview that I was involved with. Um, and... I don't know if that has the full interview in it where you would hear the rest of us talking. Because there was like a whole group of us talking. Oh my. So. Roman, there's so much. That may there. work. It may not work. But I tried. Okay. I've gotten slightly distracted. But. But there's just so much litter on my chair blanket. And it's Roman. Yes. And there, this is a Jesse dominated stream. As it always is, as it should be. David's distracted. You know, Jesse, there's a a very limited number of things that you are really good at, but luckily those things are everything that I need you to do. There's a limited number of things I'm good at. Thanks. <laughs> All right, Roman, you go beast. <laughs> Here, have your sushi. Roman Roman has a little sushi. I'm going to oh, give amazing. it to him. Wink. Ragdoll, yes, I, I think he did just shake it all over the floor. Yes, I did. Um, oh, my goodness. Okay. <laughs> and Sangi says, Hail Queen Jesse. Do some jazz hands for that one. Okay. All right, now... <clears throat> For my opening tie raid. <laughs> oh, sorry. Noel did say you compliment with an E, Jesse. Well, though, David, so we'll give you that. <laughs> I I do pretty good compliments with an I too, when I'm when I when I have a mind to. Um, okay, so we have this series right here all right this is from the original writing system and they have these curves right they're supposed to be possum tails yeah all right mm -hmm. and so i was like okay well how's that gonna sh how's that going to translate to the metal version of our of our modern writing system and so i came up with this you know spike um which was just like a half r or no a half l i guess no a half r uh -huh. well one of those two anyway I'm and, trying so hard not to sneeze. Keep I know. Going. And then I, I was like, well, this one is, is more true to it. But then I said, well, what if we try to do a curved one? And so I try to do a flat J and I try to do a curved J. And um, there were no serifs on there. And I really didn't like the look of it. I was showing it to Jesse. I was like, well, what can I do with this? And she said, why don't you try putting the serif on it that's on this one? And so then I put the serif on it. And I produced the greatest glyph I have ever produced in my entire life and it's that one it is the most amazing lip i have ever done so with that preface <laughs> jesse why don't you tell us which one actually won as a side note just to you know let you know in the comments um they think we're the best duo ever so oh. <laughs> 
Well, that's 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 nice and sweet. Yeah. I wish. Okay. Okay. So Hold the on. metal spike option, so that first one. Yeah. Um, did not get any votes at all. So. And that was good. Um, that was good. I, I I didn't like this one. I think it it changed kind of the slanted orientation of the entire font in a weird way, and so I'm glad that that spike one didn't win. Okay. In third place. In third place. Yeah. Yeah. It's the curve J. Yeah. So, patrons. <laughs> Third place. You're in trouble now. Third place. Third place. Yeah, Look at this. Six votes. Look at that. Mm. Okay. But, you know, the flat J was still pretty good. Jesse, why don't you tell us which one's in second place? Wow, look at that thunder flash. <laughs> <laughs> Second place is Flatten J. Yep. Yeah. Look at and this serif. Look at this serif on the end of this. It's amazing. But the winner. The winner is Metal Edge. Yeah, my favorite was Flatten J. I actually, the Curve J was super, super awesome. But I like the Flat J with the aesthetics of everything else going on. Um, but. I did tell David we need to, um, we can just shorten that top line a bit on that J, and I'm going to have like a new, a new icon picture for me. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah, you're right. I can just, yeah, I'll do that. I wonder, actually, I could just come up with uh, E, S, and I, and we can get, um, and we can we can spell Jesse out with this if you like it. With the line all the way across the top, so that way it yeah. all just hangs down, and you have to really look to see that it's a ESSI. Yeah, uh, um, and and not only that, um, we could keep this line extended and then extend it the appropriate amount on the right edge too. Anyway, that'll be a that'll be a later project. Um, As in tonight, because I need that immediately. Okay. You have nothing else going on in your life. No, I don't. I really don't. Okay. So, but uh, nevertheless, here I'm gonna I'm gonna put these, uh, or I'll I'll put. Uh, sorry, you liked the flattened one, even though like I was gonna say like I was gonna need to work on this one. Um, you if you see this little line here, right? This tells you kind of like how consistent it is going down, and you see that it gets a little bit wider there, and then here, it's like gets. It's crazy, right? Like this makes sense. It gets a little bit wider, but it makes sense. Here it gets a little nuts, and I wasn't sure exactly how to fix it. I, I wasn't trying to make it perfect because it just needed to be for the pole, but I wasn't necessarily satisfied. You can see the little curve there isn't the same as the little curve there, but um, then you know. Anyway, so I'll put this one in pink. Well. Um, also, like, if you think the, the curve J is better for my, my little icon, we can do that too. It's, and by we, I mean you, you know. I'll do, I'll do both. I'll do both and we'll see. Um, those need to be yellow. Now, why, okay, I can. All right. I just wasn't pressing down hard enough. Okay. <coughs> Bless you. You know, um. Although I'm. I'm a little bit upset that you, I mean, great dab. Yeah, thank you. But like, you. I'm a little upset that you took the sneeze away from me that I've been trying to work up and get out. Work that velum. For you, like. You know what to do. 20 minutes. Also, by the it's way. It's not working today. It's because I've sneezed so many times today. My body is just like, no. You know, that, so like, you know, at you and things like that. Lots of languages have um, onomatopoeic things for sneezing. Uh, but you know that they actually figured out phonetically what people say when they sneeze. And you know what it is? Kombucha. <laughs> Which is your favorite drink. Mm -hmm. Just uh, keep that association in mind. Next time you go get your 
your your your fix of your alcoholic kombucha hard alcohol raw kombucha <laughs> this one is ginger berry it's really good oh god <laughs> so delicious <laughs> Jonathan says his dad does ridiculous elaborate sneezes so the other day it was gargity 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 who <laughs> <laughs> Oh my word! Doug. And I happen to think kombucha is delicious. So if that's what a sneeze tastes like, then T TBG, by the way, is 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 to be garrulous. <laughs> Obviously. <laughs> There's go pig parade. <laughs> Dark horse says kombucha should be the possum word for God bless you. <laughs> kind of like that. I kind of like that. <laughs> it would probably come out as kombucha, kombucha, right? Because the the O would yes, probably, would. yeah, drop off. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> That's amazing. Um, okay. okay. Um, so, so I need to figure David, out. Yeah. One thing I was saying, I think while you were gone, yes. um, was that I need to catch up on dictionary entries. Mm -hmm. And so like, I think you just need to put it on the list of all the words I need to enter. And essentially what I'm going to do is ask for help as I put these in the dictionary with forms and things like that so um okay just um all right uh what page was that page um page seven you can find my cursor if you want okay do you want to start with the verbs or start with the nouns that need to be entered i'm trying entered? to remember which ones were worse i know in ingala i did not want to do verbs ever but i feel like the nouns in this language was something i was trying to avoid for a long time because didn't we not actually include very many verb forms? I'm going to tell you right now, the verbs are worse. No, there aren't as many forms, but they're much more difficult. Mm -hmm. All right. Oh, uh, so it was a Tongi saying, I wonder if something magically happens to your sneezes once you're a dad. Let me tell you, I used to be somebody that did um, inward sneezing, you know, where you close your mouth and rather than anything coming out you go inside um i used to do that exclusively um as as a kid and just all the way up to like i think maybe when i was 11 or so um but then one day somebody told me that if you do that there's a chance that you could have a brain aneurysm and die immediately uh and so after that i started sneezing the normal way and now i can't do it the other way even if I want to, I don't know how anymore. I just lost that ability. Which is good, because that's not good. I don't, I don't know if it was true. I don't know if it was true. Um, all right. Where do my windows go? Maybe list of words to look up to there remind myself how the dictionary is the dictionary of words. Oh, this is gonna be. This is gonna be fun. Okay, so. So, I wouldn't care as much about sneezing if it weren't accompanied by everything else I've got going on because I am weathering out some pretty bad allergies right now. And so, I'm just ready for that to be done. Hmm. 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 Um, I don't even remember the order of these in terms of what order we need to put them in. So S is actually going to, I'm sorry, um, Z, the voice one is actually going to have a line behind it, kind of like D. That'll be interesting. So let me grab a T. David, you're going to have to check every single form. Do you know that, right? Oh, no, 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 that's okay. I, um, I know that you've been following along very closely as we've been doing this language in the live stream, so I'm sure you're going to do them all correctly. I'm, I have total and complete confidence in you. You should not. <laughs> so, watch the space between the main 
part of the S and the line B. That is 250. Let's try 250. Um, what's 1032 plus 250? Oh, that's it. It's right there. Look at that. Oh, okay. So I can just put it at 1282. Boop, boop, boop. Now I remember what order the nouns go in, and you're right, I think the nouns are going to be easier. So yeah. you're right. I'll get that to you. Okay, somebody please make that uh, an MP3. Just Jesse saying you were right. I'm going to make it my ringtone. Um, feel free to do that. I can also make my ringtone you say romanize instead of harmonize. <laughs> no. I mentioned that when... Just wait, everybody. Wait till the podcast episode. You know, if you squint your ears when you listen to that, it sounds like I'm just saying harmonize weird. Oh, that doesn't look right. That doesn't look right. Oh, boy. Um, is everybody looking at what I'm doing, or at least are some people? Um... I don't think that... I would hope so, because right now I'm just, like, taking notes to remind myself what order these dictionary entries go in. I don't think that looks right. Um, what's the space here? Uh, space here is 125, which is half of 250. I'm going to try that. One, one, two, one, two, three, four, five. Okay. okay. Did you, sorry, did you need me to pay attention to what? Um, I would like your input. Um, cool. Wow, this is the slowest, slowest roll ever. Um, so you see the conundrum here I'm having. I don't know. So this was the, the one on the left is the one with the usual spacing. Uh, 250 in between the elements and then the one on the right um, that's half spacing where the space between these two is 125 and I also now I'm not even sure about the height the height is exactly the same as every other character that has that line down but it's just not as tall press on the back Ragdoll of the is asking you to zoom out if possible Oh my God, my left eye is like gonna start crying pretty soon since it's watering so bad. We're Don't good. go chasing waterfalls. I am totally fine. Okay, so what the one on the right really does look better. My yeah, I mean the one on the right looks better. Okay. But these are like two different. <laughs> okay. These are two different consonants, right? Back to back, and then the diacritic is the, uh, what was the diacritic indicated? Uh, don't worry, I, I think everybody else gets it. Okay. <laughs> We're gonna try something else, though. I forgot, I totally forgot. Why um, did I do that? Jonathan is asking if you could do a middle option. Um, um, I don't think so. Thank you for the, the pre kazoo type. Um, I sure hope this sneeze works its way out because if it doesn't, I feel like my nose is going to explode. Um, hmm. I suppose I could do a middle option. Oh, karma bracker of jeez. Why is everything doing why is everything defying me? Presume type. Yes, that is exactly what's going on here. Uh, oh, 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 oh. That's what you're going to do? That is what it's going to do. Hey, I'm almost ready to start the dictionary entries. All right. Well, I added another 50. Um, I don't even know what those things are called. Pika liters. 50 units. It's like, you know, the modern, you know, it's like sci-fi where all money is called credits. These are just called units. 
um, because they don't, they're not actually real units of anything. Um, but I, after, I added 50 units to A there, and so A on the left, B on the right. Does, does A look better now? Project agrees. Yeah. Jason likes it. The new spacing. Um, Stop well, it. Jay, yeah. Thing. He's lots of A's okay. coming in here. Okay. It's a bit blurry. I'm going to kind of pop up and throw in a W <laughs> or something. As he should. But now you're sniffing. Am I passing it through the screen to you? Uh. Well, it's, it's a little bit of an allergy riffic time over here as well. Uh, it's mm. because, you know, <sighs> you had rain. We did. It rained here. You know where it didn't rain today? In Missouri. Fresno. <laughs> oh. I'm just so glad I don't live in Fresno anymore. Mm. Now, oh, I remember what else I needed to do to be fully ready. You're doing a good job with the glasses. I appreciate that. Thank you. You know it bothers me, so just <laughs> use your shirt. I only did it because they're new glasses. <laughs> right. Oh, right, it's going to be all like that. Can I, like, move that tab over there? Oh, brother. Okay, now we're just going <laughs> to start over. Bib, Bib is refraining or abstaining, I should say, from this one because his judgment is clouded at the moment. Mm. Is that because it's cloudy there? Ah. Because it's cloudy. Actually, that is a reality show that I would watch. Reality show is just called Bib Loridian in Fresno. I want to see how he would manage that because my guess is not well. Hmm. Right. 88 or 10 in the morning there. It's going to be 107, probably 107 right now. Hmm. Oh, I forgot to, although now we're in the after part of the day, so I wonder if it's, oh gosh, it's got hotter since. What's wrong with Fresno Bibleridian? <laughs> well, it's wow. 107 so the there right now. Yeah. Actual temperature here now is 95, but with the heat index, it's 106. What does it say in Fresno? I don't know. I didn't look it up. One uh, second while I get my... I think Cupcake Parade is talking about a Not A Surf song, which I didn't like. Um, but uh, yeah, I think the song was true at that time, but uh, global warming has gifted us with humidity, which we never had before. And so now it rains sometimes in the summer. Um, oh, flower kicks. I'm glad you were able to stop in for a moment. Um. <laughs> 35 centigrade? What does that mean in real numbers? I will be right back. And then I'm going to start the dictionary entries. Everybody believes you. <laughs> okay. Okay, so I'm... <laughs> what are you laughing at? The Biblorian says, I'm known for wearing at least three layers when it's above 40 degrees Celsius. Which... Oh, goodness, Biblorian. Does that mean you're one of those people who keeps your house, like, super warm? That's, uh, I mean, that, that's the so, way... If so, my plans on moving into your lighthouse have just been changed. I mean, that's the way normal people like it, because it's nice to feel warm. Why would you want to feel cold? <laughs> as cold as my heart? <laughs> <laughs> 
okay. So, um... Oh, I can't do the... I don't know how to spell in this language. I can't do these entries. Why are you trusting me with this? Yeah. I'm going to need to, uh, actually start the, um... Uh, sure, fine, round them. I don't care. Though. What were you doing with that? Okay, language prefix. Let's just copy... Let's copy that whole business. Um, move over. Oh, oh, it, it, it has it. Noelle is my new favorite. Loves the cold. No, let's just leave that. Let's just leave that. Okay, and let's 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 create our first little feature, <clears throat> shall we? And we'll start with this. We do have schwa, don't we? So we're gonna want that. Okay. I'm entering the first one. By the way, I'm entering bulk, which is wrist slash ankle. All right, and then uh, I think we close it just like that, right? Or do you have to close it and say Liga and then do that? I don't remember. Okay, hold on a sec. Let me open up Angola again. I want to be sure I do it right. The yeah. L's are only voiceless at the end of words, right? Yeah, but then uh, Tepatla is actually a compound, so. No, I'm um, sorry. I'm just asking for Alk. Like, Alk is going to be just a regular voice. Yep, regular control Alk delete. And I did get it right. How about that? Look at that. I got it right. Oh, except that it disappeared. Do I have to paste it again? There we go. Oh, wait. Oh, 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 oh. Right. I don't need to do that because I can just copy this. I can delete all this. And I can say add a feature. And I'm going to add Liga. There's that Liga. And Bamski. All right. Got it. <clears throat> did we just do a bam ski? We just did. I'm going to hit this play button. What? That's not what I asked for. Play. How? Why is it doing that? You're supposed to ask me if like, I want to create those characters, and I do. Are you being obstinate? Okay, the dual form of alt is just going to be alt-she, right? Yes, because that's the proto form. Why would yeah. it change? Why would anything change with that K? Okay. Date selected auto features. All the time. I, so this thing is giving me trouble right now. Trouble I've never had before, and I'm not understanding. Are you serious? It's just. It's not letting me do anything. As you're yelling at that? Yep. From every dictionary entry, I can take out the example example, right? Because we now have the orthography um, and the spelling. But, well, but we don't, so don't bother doing that yet. We'll do it when we produce the font. So you're not counting the font that's already in there? Well, th that's one of them, but then there's going to be another. You're going to have both. You're, you're putting both in every entry. That's yeah. Yeah, of course. Okay. Like, how did you think otherwise? I thought you were going to replace the older font. Um, n no. <laughs> Why would I even have created the first one if it weren't both going to be in there? For funsies. Okay. You do stuff like that for fun. I'm finding all sorts of extra spaces in here. That's on you. It's not letting me do anything. I'm going to have to close this. I don't know. Something happened. And it's making me upset. I'm going to try to open it again. And see if it's... 
going to make me less upset. So, I believe I have the entry for wrist and ankle finished. I'll make all sorts of faces. And I believe that it's alt in the singular, alki in the dual, skulk in the plural, and uzgulk in the plural partitive. And of course, it's not an actual u because I forget I shouldn't be rounding. I feel like David needs a hug. That is probably a better thing for me to receive than what I am thinking of doing to my computer right now. Yeah, you need a hug. Is there anything I can do from a distance? Can you strangle this program from a distance? I mean, I can do my best, but I offer no promises. What the hell? I'm going to quit the stupid program and open it again, and then everything's going to be fixed. And if it's not, I'm Applesauce gonna... Project asks if you're still trying to work from Dropbox. I mean, that shouldn't matter because I can still save it. <laughs> Thank you, Dark Horse. Rounding is okay. The river rounds the roughest edges. Yes, that is that is perfection. Oh my god, that makes me so happy. Um Okay, so I am taking away the top entry under nouns because it is complete. We now have dictionary entries. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> it's not letting me do anything. At all. And I don't know what to do about that. I don't know why it's doing this. So Applesauce Project followed up with it could be a networking issue if the program can't handle being able to process if the file is natively on the computer. If the, if the file is what? Native, isn't natively on your computer. Okay. I mean, it seems to be saving it, but we'll go ahead and try something different. Right, so now I'm going to do an entry for shell. Not really. I swear I remember how to alphabetize things and so I have to create a trish. Is it in here? It is. Place. put stress on the wrong syllable. Seven. 
Okay, um... I don't know if I'm actually on the same window or if people are seeing a ghost of the old window. Um. So I'm going to redo that. There we go. Okay. Pronouncing Z H. Mm. What? Um, Z H. What? Hmm. Z H is r. Retroplex. It's the curly J, right? An I P A. Hmm. No. It's the uh, Z with the tail. Um, Z Y is the Curly J. There we go. I see how that's supposed to. And you're right, Dark Horse. There's only one syllable, so I don't really know why I was worried about putting stress on the front. <laughs> it's just what happens sometimes. And yes, Jonathan, you are absolutely right. Um, Interesting. Ah, kombucha. You keep stealing my sneezes. I need to sneeze. Okay, so it's going to let me work in our lig, but not in Liga. Could it be because what is our lig? required ligatures? Auto generate code for selected features. That could be the issue. I don't want it to do that. How do I unclick that? Update on compile, update auto features, import features. Um, hmm. Maybe if I... And then I have a question for you when you're able to focus on the apps. Maybe. Just one moment. It's still starred. This... Like, how could they have changed the entire program to, to be like this? Like, without me knowing it? Is this suggesting that I can't use the feature Liga anymore? Like... That's ridiculous. But that appears to be exactly what's happening. Like, this is bananas. This, like, large bananas. The biggest bananas anybody has ever seen. Look at this Liga. Look at this Liga. See, it's not starred. It's not starred. That's the difference. That's why it's not letting me do it, because it's starred. But then how do I unstar it? I don't want it to be starred. Nobody wants it to be starred. Nobody wants the stars for this thing. And you usually, if you press a thing where it's like it's gray here, and then you press it and it's black, then you press it again to make it go gray, but it's not doing it. Oh, right. You don't even see any of this. That's the thing. They don't even see any of this. That's why I just wanted to get it done quickly.
because, okay, so here's the thing. So the reason why I was doing this is because we're actually done with all the main glyphs, right? Um, but the thing is, like, um, you know, I could put it in for S and Z, but I couldn't put it in for Sh and Z because those require a ligature. They require the SH ligature and the ZH ligature. And so I just wanted to write them up really quick so I could paste it in, right, and be done. But, but... Oh. You won't let me do it. Anyway. And yes, you can't even see it. We, you could it's see a smile it. smile for you. Thank you. You could see it if I did this. You could see it if I did this. Um, here's, here's where I'm at down here. Um, and it's very small. Um, so I know um, that it'll be hard to see. I'm not sure if you can increase... Uh, the font size of that. I don't think I don't think you can increase the font size of this. Um, so what happens is that there are features here, right? And, you, and there are all these features: stylistic alternate, sci scientific inferior, small caps, like a whole bunch of things that you can do. Um, Liga is the standard one, and it's standard ligatures, and it's well, it's not there because I already added it. Um, and it, there are these things where you could star it, and if you star it, it says auto-generate code for selected features. And I don't know if I accidentally pressed it or what, but it is thinking that it's auto-generating code for Liga, which is the standard ligatures, and it's not letting me undo it. Like if you press this star, nothing happens. It's like, it's like once you press it, it's done. It's like I need to create a brand new font to make it not do that. And I, um, can yes. you tell me the exact version and program again? This is Font Lab seven point. So it's seven point two point zero point seven six four four. Seven point two point zero. What was after that? Point seven six four four. Um, okay, and this is star on Liga. Jason says, can you remove the Liga out of the left column with the minus sign and re-add it without the auto code? Yeah, that's actually what I just did. So, and I'll, and I'll do it again so that you can see. So I remove it, and I go back. Where is, uh, there it is, standard ligatures. And Hello, Alexander. And there it is, it's it's already starred. Something that's kind of interesting, it had a dot. Well, that's funny. So D-Lig has an empty one. Wow, I think I just killed Safari. There we go, okay. Um... Oh dear. Huh. But it's letting me do it. So D leg is starred, but it's letting me do it. Okay. I wanted to use Liga because I know it works. It'll work like in Word too. Um, I don't want to have to do R leg because sometimes it won't work. So it's but I still feature. can't edit Liga. Um, it says if the feature in the list has a bullet, Font Lab will auto generate the feature definitions. Okay, I don't know what that is. There means. a bullet in something? There is. Um. And if you have existing feature definitions, it says you can click the star button at the top of the features panel to auto-generate its contents. Ah. A second. Yeah. Liga would be a cool word. Oh, my word. The sneeze is really coming now. be 
these seeds. It occurs to me, you probably never heard of the band Divine Comedy, and so you don't know the song, um, the pop singers, uh, the pop singers fear of the pollen count. No. I think you'd like it. And it's, it's very apropos. Everybody dial it up. And thank you to everybody. I accept your blessings. Hmm. The gay thing. Wishes for health. A gay sig is a wonderful word. What is? Uh, that that uh, it's a it's a Hungarian word. I'm guessing it means uh, mm -hmm. some equivalent of bless here. Ooh. Oh my goodness! This is a great collection right here of all the ways to. Mm -hmm. Um, okay, did you want me to read that again, or did you already know everything I just said about the, the features? Uh, yes, unfortunately what you said was not going to help, but I appreciate okay. it. Well, I'll just say I'm not done searching for star in the manual. It's in features. Ooh, maybe I shouldn't look up star. Maybe I should look up asterisk. Because it's an asterisk, really, that's the problem, right? No, it's a star. Oh, it is a star. Yeah, okay. it's a star. Never mind. Okay, that's all I can find in the manual. Oh, Jason, sure, I could I could write the code myself, but then once I... It has to be in this window, and it has to be accepted, otherwise it's not going to do anything. Um, so, uh, and furthermore, like, I don't want these substitutions. I don't want it subbing FI by the FI ligature, because um, I'm not going to use it. In fact, it didn't even work. So, it's a gay shade with two long A's and a geminate esh. Oh, oh, because, oh, I'm sorry, I missed the other S. So SZ is just an S, but regular S is SH, and so I guess when S precedes SH, it becomes the geminate. That makes sense. Um. But, like, yeah, but the, it's, that's not the issue. Like, yeah, I can do that whatever I want. I could do it in R leg. I can do it in whatever. But in order for it to work, it needs to get pasted into Liga and then, you know, oh, whoops, um, and then actually work. Um, oh. Hmm. Hmm. Hang on a sec. Hang on a sec. Hang on. Then I still have a pronunciation question, but I will write it down to remember to come back to it. Nope, it's not going to work. Okay, we're going to, that's it. We're doing this in our league then, because why would this thing work exactly the way it's always worked for the past 20 years? I did nothing to this. I did nothing to this. No. What's your pronunciation question, Jess? In this language, yes. is Z D Z H A A K. I'll type that in the comments. Um, Z -Z -H -A 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 -K. Is that a pronounceable unit? Zjach. Yeah. Is that good? I don't see why not. Um, okay. I just wanted to make sure. I mean, it's not specifically forbidden, so why not? That's that's the way this. I didn't know if it was forbidden, and I couldn't find another example, and so uh, I was just asking because that will be the plural form of shell. So that is shells. Okay. Yeah. 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 There's nothing wrong with that. I mean, that that was why we were doing this language that way to you know 
to Oh, I know, but you know Liga me and not being able to pronounce things, so then I'm like, nobody can pronounce that. They would totally add a vowel. Oh, wow. Your, your voice is amazing right now because you sound like when, like on a cartoon, when the voice actor is trying to make the character sound like they have a cold. <laughs> See, it's a trick. I'm really not sick at all. I have no allergy problems at all. I'm just, I'm just, you know, pretending. I have no allergy problems at all. Sorry. My no, God, my eye is terrible. watering again. <laughs> I need Minnie here. She would have some choice words for you. Oh, yeah. What's she doing anyway? I don't know. Wow. Space right there. This is exciting. Okay. Here's what? is next, right. which of course, there we go. Needs stomach, tummy, <laughs> belly. Okay, we need those the first. external part of the stomach. Okay. And now, all right, we're gonna, I know that we were pasting glyphs up there and everything, but that's not what we're gonna do. We're gonna we're gonna substitute them all, um, so that they all have their own things. So we're gonna substitute uh, K H by, because um, K H the H it's a separate phoneme, right? Here, why don't I have my thing open? What was? H is a separate phoneme, yes. There it is. Yes. Okay. Substitute KH by um, KH to Pahla. That will be the names of the glyphs. Um, substitute SH by SH to Pahla. Substitute ZH by ZH to Pahla. Um, and now. <laughs> Ragdoll says, Minnie is busy with art camp now. Jake says, and being a lesbian, the agenda never sleeps. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, that was, that was funny. Um, as a side note, beautiful is just going to be spelled RBT because everything in the protoform was schwa's. Yeah, yeah. Cool. Isn't that fun? Yeah, I love it. <laughs> Nothing wrong with it, I just was excited. Okay, so uh, I'm gonna need some help when it comes to the um, uh, oh. Do we still not have a separate E and I? I forget. That's a really good question. No, we don't. We don't have a separate um, E, so E is going to be substituted by I. Um, Evan, no, we're not going to be getting to the numbers today. That won't be until we both are fully on the same page, literally. Yeah, probably not going to get to it this season. We'll do it later. We'll do it off screen. Um, okay. Um, oh, I forgot to put C entry because stomach is external only. Okay. Three words have been entered in the dictionary. <laughs> and David has had one meltdown. This is, this episode is good. Quickly. And now I'm getting a call from Prattsville, Arkansas. That's the best place to be, obviously. What does J do in our romanization? Does it do anything? What do you mean? Like, do we have J in our romanization? I don't think we do. I don't think we do. Oh yeah, anime fan, we did it. Mm -hmm. 
Okay, so then Jay is going to be... Um, so now I'm ready for Kairun, Hummingbird. Uh, I had a question about um, uh, the palatals. Do they, are they separate ever or no? You mean the... Um, like ya and cha and cha, are they ever separate? I don't think they are. No, because they all, the protoforms. Good, okay. Because the, the palatal series is entirely allophonic um, Got it. through sound change. Okay, good. Not allophonic. It's new through sound change, and so it's not in any of the proto. Mm. Okay, oh, we're going to substitute by you. Oh, man. Oh, I know, I gotta go back to the case. <laughs> My thing isn't doing the. Ah! What? Technology is not your friend today. No. Yeah. A regular R, and on our list we left the Kiron entry as a regular R, so I had to go verify to make sure that we didn't have two types of R's and that's missing one. No, no. no. We're good. I'm fixing that on my... Okay. And um, the, um, just to double check, when we have that uh, voiced by labial fricative, that is just... Um, uh, a phi being voiced, right? Yes. Alright, and W is also just a phi, right? W is something that comes from, well, the two, the voiceless and the voiced, come from either the R at the end of a word or, um, and yeah, I believe a phi is another source of that. But they are, neither of them are in proto forms. Okay. I think that, yeah, let's just do that. And then Z. And then for our, for our digraphs, we have KH, SH, and ZH that are actual phonemes. Other than that, we're good. I should just stay on the, the one chart and not jump in the dictionary. Oh, Alk is here now. We entered your word, Alk. Yes, we did. It's in the dictionary for real now. It's not just in a list. You also missed everybody being totally cool and nothing going wrong. Mm -hmm. Um. All right. There we go. How are we doing uh, the retroflexes? Was that, that was SH and ZH, right? Yeah. Okay, so those are the others. So KH, SH, ZH. Yeah. And we were just using F for phi, right? Yes. Okay, so. so those are your digraphs. I've entered a bunch of stuff. Let me make sure that, all right. <laughs> no, it says, yep, David had cool the entire time. Yeah, so I think then we need a little pick-me-up to get through the rest of this. You ready? Oh, is it that time for me? Yeah. Oh, you know what? Just a second. I'm also going to down my kombucha before I do it because oh, this... they don't mix. Afterwards, they don't mix. Done. You just enjoyed the heck out of that kombucha, didn't you? I did. Really enjoyed drinking that and... Okay. Well, 
I'm down for the original today. As in, well, as am I, but like, I always am, so. Got it. Ready? Cheers. Cheers. Oh. oh, Evan, I'm sorry to hear that your dreams are broken. It's always a tough thing to come around to. Oh. Oh my god, I just realized. For when I'm everything, saying. everything is going right in your life. You want me to scroll to somewhere in the document, by the way? No, like, I'm down in the dictionary jumping all over the place, so, yeah. like, I don't, I don't know where to take people. I don't know. Because we put off doing dictionary entries for too long. Mm -hmm. And I had too much fun for two weeks just creating words. And now I'm paying for it. It's like for anybody who's, you know, written a paper where you have to do the citations. And you're like, I'll do the citations at the end. And then you get to the end and you're like, well, crap. Now I have to do the citations. It's like that. Yeah. I'm going to give this a try, see if it works. Nope. That was a that was a valiant effort, uh, Devin. So thank you for the suggestion. Did not work. Did not work. Another wow. approximate story. The Snow Stealer. Hummingbird has been entered. We've got Harun, Harun T. Zucaron and Uzgaron. Okay. That was beautiful pronunciation. I know. I'm gonna make these red. Wait. Uh oh. Yep. The schwa breaking into a diphthong, does that have to do with stress? The schwa becoming a diphthong. I don't know that that's ever happened. If you look at the word for hummingbird, which is on the screen still. Um. Oh, God. Oh, no, I've got this I don't know about that. Let's go to Lecture G real quick. Oh. Because anyway, it's not going to be stress. Oh. Once we add the yeah, I guess so. dual, it's going to change. So what's going to happen when you add the dual? Um, well, let's take a look. Because... Dual proto form. Uh, Kalenchi. Kalenchi. So it's just a, it's just an O, just a regular O. Just O. It's not O U. Yeah, it doesn't have to do with the stress. It has to do with the fact that it got lengthened. Okay. Um, now, let's make sure I got this right. Now I finished hummingbird. S has the thing in front. Ash doesn't have the thing in front. So then, this is Ash right here. Got it. And Z should look like. There. And this one. Let's get rid of that. Good. Um, 
too glad I've had the wherewithal to start with nouns instead of verbs. <laughs> totally my decision. Oh, I need to put in something for C. Now I'm on to river. Shoot, I forgot to change the pronunciation. I am a hot mess today. You really should not be trusted. <laughs> I can't wait to go back and look at these and I'll be all like, oh. Look at all that stuff I added. You're, you're really going to be in the market for a new partner after this. Yeah. No. Also, um, I think I got a. Hold on a sec. Yeah, I need to. So I'm actually down here. So I think I'm gonna have to make this smaller. Let's, let's so people can see where I am. It's teeny tiny. Oh well, but at least you can get an idea of what I'm doing. K Y is a palatal stop, right? Uh, no, T Y. Shoot, K Y. K Y is nothing. Mm -hmm. Okay. Cool. Then our word for river has been misromanized. Yes. This is my alphabetized because that should be. You know what? I'm off the protoform in Lexuji. I'll let Lexuji be word. That's actually a really handy feature of Lexuji. You can just have it spell things for you. Mm-hmm. So our word for river is totally wrong. Itch. Okay. Oh wait. River. Never mind. It's only partially wrong. It just needs to be re redone. Cute. Let's see. Wait, wait. Oh. I I have a little typo in the proto form. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Total, totally fine. And I'm sure you know what typo I had too. I'm really intrigued by what John has just typed. Nice. I'll be in Vermont for the actual first time later this year. I could have sworn I'd been before, but then I couldn't think of when that would have been. But I hear it's beautiful too. I mean, you could say that about potentially anywhere. I could have sworn I'd been to Russia before, but I guess not. Alright. But, did you actually swear you'd been there? I guess I could lie about the swearing. Or that could have been, could have sworn. Hey, what is a barred I in the proto form for spelling? Nothing. It oh, oh, like oh, oh, I'm sorry. Oh, um, you, you hit the Y button and then it flips it. So type an I, hit the Y? Uh, no, no, no. Like... So, like the the Romanized form of what you're you're typing is K I R Y F. K I R Y F. Yes. Correct. Cool. Got it. Am I, am 
bird, I'm accidentally in North Carolina. <laughs> By the way, you know this song yet? Do you know Carolina in my mind yet? Yeah, I think that's the one time you said it. Too. Okay, good. What about one bourbon, one scotch, one beer? Did you listen to that? Not yet. Oh. Sorry, I've been busy today. Oh, you Okay. I'll get to it though. Yeah. Okay. Although maybe not right after the stream because I'm going to have dinner made for me. Fried catfish, onion rings, your favorite, and halibut. <gasps> halibut is my favorite. Mm -hmm. So are the, are the onion rings. I mean, they're so that you can raise the halibut on a little platform. But then, just like you wouldn't eat a platform, you wouldn't eat the onion rings. What would the point be? Now I'm entering mouse, mouse. I just know that at some point in time, if ever I'm treated to a dinner, you're just going to just cover everything with onions. It's going to be fried onions with onions on top. You know it. Hmm. And I would like to point out that I have actually made dinner for you before when you were in Nacogdoches and it had onions in it. And you commented on how delicious it was. Yeah, it was really good. You know what you're doing. Mm. Okay. By the way, you know that Carolina in my mind, it's... James Taylor made it famous, but Melanie Safka wrote it and performed it. Melanie Safka has some good stuff. You gotta be like in the right frame of mind for it, but she's got some good stuff. By the way, uh -huh. Miles, I love catfish too. Um, I think we were so overwhelmed with L words in our last language that we avoided it so hardcore that right now we only have one L word this entire language and it's the word for ear or rabbit <laughs> well you could make liga a word <laughs> i mean that's what that's what has been suggested hmm. <laughs> hmm. you know what i want to do that pretty funny you know what i want to do i mean people are going to see a little me but i'm thinking I'm yeah, I think I, I'm going to do this. I'm going to make what I'm doing a lot bigger. And then I'm just going to put you on top of it. Because we, we don't want to deprive people of you. But that was just too small. Um, I mean, I don't think I'm doing enough exciting stuff at the moment for it to really matter. And now they can see another little me. Mirrored. Because it's flipped. Oh, it sure is. Yeah. Okay. So, here's the part, by the way, where we need to figure out exactly how we're going to do this. So, um, the ancient script, the things flip from top to bottom. In this one, they're going to get a second diacritic. It's going to go on top, just to this uh, dot diacritic. Um, and so, um, I think what we have to do is there has to be a way to do it, just uh, manually. So I'm going to, I'm just going to use the Y. It'll be fine, just like in the in the old version. Uh, but then we also want it to f to do that flippy thing when it would be there naturally. Well observed, Cupcake Parade. Um, was I... It's going to need more code. You? Was I supposed to be listening to everything? I don't know. If, I don't know if supposed to is a, is the way that we want to run with with this. So um, it, so 
it's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. It's fine. Just... Like, sorry, I do have a problem trying to figure this one. So I'm gonna call this, um, I'm gonna call these, uh, mm, flip. So KH flip to Pafla, SH flip to Pafla, ZH flip to Pafla, and so on. Now we need to do the others. I have to figure out how to make this one dual. Um, Jonathan, that suits me to a T right now. I was totally looking at him. My, my ears just stopped listening for a minute. Sorry. Doesn't hurt me. You say that now. Nothing you do can hurt me. Hmm. 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 What do we do with him? Hmm. Hmm. The entry for trail and path is done. Now I'm putting it on the English side. So we have miles, which of course people are going to remember actually came from Miles because he figured out a mathematical thing and was rewarded with a word. Okay, we don't need that. I'm done with mine. I just crunched down on the last little bit that was left. Oh. Does that mean I, I win or you get... win? What's that? <laughs> I'm sorry. Does that mean I win or you win? Well, I win because I had a, I had the flavored goodness for longer, so I win. But my experience was more intense. What? More intensity, or do you want more time? I, okay, it's an open question. I just don't know. Oh my God, I'm gonna sneeze again. Mm. Wow, I really thought I'd be able to make it through a lot more words. I forgot how long these stupid entries take when you're doing them by yourself. Yeah. I'm sorry, they're not stupid. That was mean of me. <laughs> I, I didn't mean to say it that way. It's too late. I've already been devastated. It's out there. It's out there. Luca. Luca. <laughs> okay. Oops. Let's try that. You know, before I do these, I should figure out the um, where I want these side bearings to be, so I don't have to do these twice. Oh, that's a bummer. You know what I mean? So here's the thing. What happens when uh, let's do those features? Um, our leg. Uh, hold on a sec. Uh, yes. Oh, that would just be an O. Uh, the carrot top, when you're doing the orthography, you would just type an O, right? Yeah. Cool. What does Luca mean? Mm -hmm. Snail, of course, of course it means snail. Okay, let's try that. Uh, let's make this a little bit smaller. 
So what happens when these two things come next to each other? I guess they're, okay. Okay, okay. But, hmm. This is gonna be difficult. We'll really have to decide where each of these side bearings sit quite precisely. Gosh, this is gonna to be tough. Jake, Jake, it's never too late for that. Go on, sorry. That's gonna to be tough. <laughs> I've finished. Snail, four words. Surely I can make it through four words in 18 minutes, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, um, let's try. This, this, um, let's take one of those, and maybe one of these. Oh, actually, okay. I think I need to actually, uh, all right. Okay, this is going to be a little difficult because what we're going to be doing is trying to decide where these things are actually going to sit. Whoa, look at all those numbers. Wow, oh, that's kind of cool. Oh, whoops. Hard to be doing other things at the same time you're doing that because I really want to look at everything you're talking that. I think you're telling everybody else to look at it, but... Yeah. So we're... we're hmm. Okay. There's that one. Um, oh, thank you, Miles. Now I believe in me, too. Um, Jonathan, um, Nuka is the word for snail. And now I've finished the word for bath. Yay! I'm getting slightly faster. And on your screen, you should see that a snail shell, snail shell, <laughs> I can say it, is Jakvukaan. Because who doesn't want to know how to say that? Okay, on to Whisker. Let me do the English side first, because that's the easy side. Whisker. Why? Okay. So, this is the hard part. We need to figure out what the spacing is going to be because we're not just going to be hitting the space bar. I mean, you could. Now, that'll, that'll be in between words. But, like, essentially, we have to figure out the kerning because we need to figure out how much these lines should hang over the edge. Um, I believe on the screen my window is blocking... Shoot a good portion. Yeah. Uh, Miles, in this case, the ah uh, is actually um, the possession marker. Um, and Noel, yeah, you're absolutely right that there's a whole other list of nouns. I just wanted to finish that top part of the list because, again, I waited forever to do these entries and now I'm paying the price. Okay. Can you zoom out a tad? Oh, uh, yeah. By any chance. So, like, imagine that this is supposed to be a single word, you know? And so you're going to need to know that that one line is its own character, right? Right. 
In fact, let's uh, just for the, the time being here, let's go ahead and delete that because it, it there could be one that looks like that. That's a T. Yeah. It feels to me like there's too much space in between the T, the D, and then this one, whichever that one is. I think it's phi. The one with the, the four shape? Yeah. It yeah. does. Um... Does this feel right? And does this feel right? The amount of space between the phi and the t for me, I think, is too far. Yeah. But then to figure out how much space, it also feels a bit a bit too far between the t and d. But you don't want to get it too close, otherwise. So it's gonna it's it's gonna have to be longer than whatever that distance is, and I think it's two fifty. It is two fifty. So it's got to be longer than two fifty. Otherwise, there could be confusion. <laughs> Dark Horse, that's amazing. Dark Horse is saying this portion of, of what you've written is cutie pie. Because <laughs> it looks like a Q, a C, and then the pie. <laughs> okay. Um, All right. That gives me an idea. That gives me an idea. Okay. Gives me an idea with what to work with. All right, so um, let's put, a, put that in yellow so we know it's not real. It doesn't change a bit. That's fascinating. Hmm. Oh, and okay. Remind me again, bar die in a proto form. I need to use a Y. Yeah. In the orthography. Uh huh. I have an idea. I have a tentative plan. I have a tentative plan. Whisker should be done. <coughs> Let's see. Thank you. What's four? What's seven fifty seven minus four seventy six? Something that is a die. No, sorry, it is a point. Seven fifty seven minus four seventy six. Yeah. Usually, I can do math in my head, but I think I sneezed. My math. Right out. Here, let's see. 757. 57 minus 456. 476. Okay, 281. 281 on the left. And now we need to know what is 1563 minus 1282. 281. So it's the same, right? It's the same. Okay. So they're both 281. Okay. Okay, I can deal with that. Okay. Okay. That that's good. That, then they're both the same because then what we're gonna do is we're gonna set the side bearings. Um to negative 281 on both sides. OK. 
Okay. And that should put that right there. Yeah. Now let's see what happens. Let's see what happens. OMG. Well, I sure didn't do anything. I just realized something that I have now messed up. No, I still have the list of what I did. Okay, these ligatures aren't loading at all. They're just not working. That's that's a big problem. That's that's a that's again why you don't want to work with anything other than the standard ligatures because sometimes they just don't work. Ah, like they're just not doing it. They're just not doing it. I'm gonna try to open up a new window and see if that makes a difference. But like, I'm compiling it, I'm saving it. All right then. And then let's just go here. And they're not freaking doing it. They're not even letting me click on it. Do you think this may be like something where the computer itself needs to be restarted? I don't think so. Is it a break? Okay, yeah. I'm on my last noun for today and somebody yeah, yeah. somebody had asked, oh Noel, there we go, if we have poll ideas yet and I don't believe we do. Unless you had something you knew you wanted to do. I'm so frustrated right now. I totally understand why I really, really, really wish I could help you right now. Okay. Okay. That worked. That worked. This little button was impressed. All right. So, okay, here's the big question. Um, jump down here. Now, there, there might be extra spacing that needs to be fixed. Uh, uh, okay, so we'll deal with that as we come to it. But, Yeah, there's definitely extra spacing that needs to be fixed. Um, so what I want you to do is just focus on this is a D and this is a double T. Can you tell the difference? Okay, so we're comparing I can tell the difference. D double T. Because the, the double T's on the top, right? Yeah. The, the spacing is wrong on this one because the, 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 the spacing on the right and left of this is going to be the same. It's only going to be the spacing in between those two little legs. That's going to be different. Let me see if I can um, shore that up real quick. So I decided it was going to be 150 on the left, 250 on the right. Um,
250 on the right. Uh, repeat set side bearings. Okay, there we go. That's it in all its glory. Mata versus Mad. I'm sorry, Mata versus Madda. Sorry, Mata versus Madda. That was it. I see the difference. Uh, Miles want to know what the actual spacing was between them. Uh, this is 250, this is 350. And essentially what I'm going to do is I'm going to decide what the left edge... Oh yeah, definitely. Uh, won't hold up in handwriting. I mean, I think... Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Well, let's uh, let's 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 get let's get chomping on the rest of this. Um. So that. Okay. Two fifty. Oops. One fifty. Did that one for this one? Okay, I have done with my list of downs with two minutes to spare. <laughs> we'll we'll stay a little bit later because you know. Because we were late. Yes, because both of us were late. And both of us need to feel really bad about that. And how late we were. I'll alphabetize the list below it to make it easier when I'm ready. Hmm, for this one. Just thank you all of you if you need my attention. Because for this one. It could go there. I'm not sure. We can try that and see if that will end up overlapping. And this, so this is an interesting question, where this right edge is going to be. 626 is not a regular interval, so we're going to make that regular. Let's make it 600. And so we're going to call it uh, 1600. Uh, and so this should be at 1850. Um, if you're able to zoom out whenever you're showing it again, that would be appreciated. Okay. And Magpie's making a great point that English N N and M are distinguishable usually, and when they're not, context tells us which one is intended. Uh, not N N, it's R N. Oh yeah, R N. Oops. Okay. Six twenty six. Oh, yeah. That is a lot of words to be from the dictionary. Why, why did you procrastinate that anything? <laughs> Wanted to give you something to do. Now I've got something to do. <laughs> okay. And I feel bad for everybody, like, having to watch it, because it's not as much fun as it could be. It's crazy that everybody is on here for a school assignment. 
and like they have to watch the whole thing or they don't get an A for the day. Now I know what I'm going to have my students do for homework in the fall. Oh, We're going to jump up by a lot of students. <laughs> Let me make sure that's right. Yeah, 150. Um, oh my word. What do you declare? Which word, Jesse? Mine. You have so many. I have them all, really. What's 974 plus 250? 1224. We'll try that. We'll try that. I'm not sure if that's going to work, but we'll try that. How you doing over there? You doing all right? I feel like somebody should call me up my nose or something. Yeah. What do you think you're going to do after this? Go get food. Did Just, you not hear me with the catfish and the onion rings? Oh yeah, I know. But like, you're gonna do that immediately? I don't know why. I don't know. I'm just curious. <laughs> I mean, as immediately as I'm able, sure. Pack up still. Because you know, if you want, like, we could, you know, spend a little extra time afterwards entering words into the dictionary. You a lot faster, wouldn't it? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay. Oh, and I can make you do the verbs, and I'll just do the English side. 219 minus 150, 69, dudes. Another reference you don't get. Okay. <sighs> because you haven't seen Bill and Ted's at School Adventure. What's wrong with you? We're going to try doing the same thing here. Wow, 350. What was I thinking, huh? Okay. I um, mean, yeah, Miles, it, it does get breaded, usually with some sort of cornmeal concoction. That's pretty cool. Man, that, that first time I had halibut, that was a day. I really like halibut. You know... I'm going to make sure that uh, you mail some of that to me, right? And it's going to taste so good by the time it gets there. Darn right it is. Uh, make those purple. Oh, Dark Horse, be excellent to each other. That would be one thing to translate. Mm. Man, that would be tough. We'd have to figure out how to do the reciprocal first. <laughs> <laughs> we won't even talk about the whole be excellent part. It's the whole reciprocal that I just stopped playing. Okay, so um, let me see if this worked. Okay, so they are working. Ligatures are working. Then why is there so much space? Be why is there so much space? Oh my gosh, Miles, is that the combination of sriracha and mayo? Is that what you just put in there? Sriracha yo? That sounds amazing. Okay, 250, and then. I guess that's 157. It's not supposed to be that. It's supposed to be. But, like, that's not actually going to be that big a deal anyway. Yeah, that's not going to be that big a deal. It, it just still feels like there's a lot of space between these two guys. Okay, but what else do we need to test? What are some like other characters being next to characters that we need to test? That's a wonderful question. Something with a, a sharp right edge and then a sharp left edge. Let's do K and uh, S. Um... Oh, Jonathan, that's fun too, Miacha. Oh, that sure doesn't work. 
That sure doesn't work. Look at that. Look at that. Right. We don't I'm like. Waiting for it to show up. Yeah, we don't like the look of that. What? What's going on there? Uh, well, I just didn't have this thing go all the way over, and so it 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 just. It just didn't do it, by golly. Um, and, and so, like, even if I had the, even if I had the line come up to this dot right here to make the full line, this thing would be way overlapping, way overlapping. So it looks like I am gonna have to. Oh, oh, look at that. Well, look at that. I. What was I even doing? Did I even? Did I not even do that one? Did I even do this one? Like. What was, where did I, did I not start there? I don't even know where we are here. I do, however, love, I'm seeing on YouTube that I've got all sorts of fun face expressions going on. And I promise you, it's all the allergies, guys. I'm not looking dead-eyed. Okay, let's, okay, so let's. Let's figure this out here. So this needs to go forward, but to where? I think it needs to go forward to like, to be in line with this line, I think. Oh yeah, that's... Or maybe a little bit. No, I think it needs to go a little bit more than that, doesn't it? And Daniel, this is Font Lab 7. I think it needs to be a little bit more than that. Let's... So should we talk about the poll that we're going to put out? <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Or should that just be a surprise? I have zero ideas. Absolutely none. Um, and I so think... patrons, it's going to be a surprise. Well, or, um, or, or, or you can just come up with it right now on the spot. I was just going to say, like, I've got maybe one more minute, and I need to disappear so I can go blow my nose because I'm trying to avoid nose blowing sounds on the live stream. I hear that. Okay, fair enough. Jonathan is saying, perhaps, what do possums say for bless you? Of course, it would have to be the English Shit. translation. Oh we, God, I can't believe I did that. Sort of... Can't believe I did that. Oh, all right. Um. Yeah, I, I, I'm totally down for that. That's that sounds good and everything. Put this at negative one twenty. Um, w Watson is suggesting reciprocals. Reciprocals. What about those? So that way we can say, be excellent to each other. Hmm. How do you, how do you think we might do that? How how might we do like a poll for reciprocals? Do you have any ideas? No. Not unless we came up with multiple strategies and said vote for your favorite strategy. Hmm. Or we could like do, hey everybody, come up with a strategy for our reciprocals. <laughs> and then vote on no. them. No. No. This is something we want to make sure there's options for otherwise. Yeah. otherwise. I think this could be fun. Let's Let's start with the idea of, you know, remembering that Russian does friend to friend. Let's start there. And what's 219 minus 150? I swear I'm almost done. 69. Here, I got it. I got it. I got it. 69, of course. It all makes sense. <laughs> okay. Um, it's that one. But Dark Horse, that's assuming that they have weeks and that they measure time in the same way we do. And it probably wouldn't. So. Okay. And then we can do all these. <laughs> enemy to enemy is a possum year. <laughs> and that still didn't work? How about tail to tail. That, that's actually not bad. We'll make that um, one of them. Um, okay, where's regular K? Just give me give me one little moment, Ski. How is that not working? How is that not working? Oh my god. 
Okay. 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 Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. It's an S. Yes. Okay. What? What? Where's the side bearing? Where's the side? The side bearing's not in the right place. How could the side bearing not be in the right place? How is the side bearing not in the right place? I. Minus 281. Like, like, the, what? Hang on, hang on. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Is that one different from all the other ones for no reason whatsoever? Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. <gasps> it's different from the other ones for no reason whatsoever. Oh my god. How did I do that? And now I'm getting a phone call. And 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 everything is just okay. I'm going to figure this out on my own. Next week will be fine. We are going yeah. to go. Yes. Because otherwise, things are going to get thrown. Anyway, thank you for enjoying this very, very calm. Very, very soothing. Very soothing. Very standard episode of Lang Time Studio. We love you very much. <laughs> yes, we do. And stay grammar. Bye, everybody.